Welcome to the shortwave radio channel. And um, some of you out there have talked to me about a new sunspot that uh, was uh, that actually appeared on the sun yesterday. Um, that was uh, Sunday, April 26th. And uh, were asking me what I thought about uh, solar cycle at the same time because we talk about it regularly. And I like to update from time to time we are where we are in the solar cycles and all of that. So yes, 2760 is the number. It is a sunspot, a very small sunspot in the uh, center, uh, almost the equator, the center of the sun's disk. If we look here, you could see it uh, right here, a little cluster of spots here that we, uh, we could see here. So uh, of course, that is uh, the a, a sunspot from the old uh, cycle. Um, and how do we know? In two reasons, two two ways. First of all, it's very close to the equator. Uh, that indicates that it probably was from the old cycle. New cycles start typically at higher latitudes on the sun. Also, you can check the uh, you know with the instruments they can check the polarity of the spot. It is the polarity of the old cycle. New cycle spots have a reversed polarity. So um, it's probably one of the last times we see an old cycle sunspot, especially in the last few sunspots were all new cycle. So this is kind of a remnant of, of the old cycle at some point. But it's uh, interesting to see that something is happening. So this is probably going to rise our uh, solar flux a little bit. It's at 69 right now. But um, don't expect, you know, any major, unless it really grows real huge. Um, and don't expect that many changes here in, in propagation. It might enhance it a little bit. So where we are at, we're still at solar minimum. I mean, if you look at the number of days without sunspots, 90 days is 76% of the total for 2020. We are in a deep solar minimum. And that is what the conditions are going to be for the next few weeks, probably. But as we go through 2020, I, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm one of those that um, suspects that that as we get through our go, uh, you know, through the the end of 2020, we might start seeing a little more sunspot activity, and so um, that would be a nice indication that uh, the new solar cycle is slowly kicking up. So that's what's happening, and of course, uh, in general, propagation has been uh, quite good. I'm very surprised. Uh, with the um, with the activity lately, so this is spaceweather.com. It's a website, one of the websites I go and check out quite often for solar activity details. Another one that is uh, nice is uh, solarham.net, which is another uh, one that is kind of interesting here with uh, updates on what's happening on the sun. Also, so uh, that is little details that we have for solar activity and what's happening on the sun and the solar cycles. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.